Hello students watching and everybody. Today is our next lesson <clears throat> in arithmetic. So now today we're going to be learning about <clears throat> these differences. Let's read from 51 to 100. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So now, did you all enjoy this lesson? Did you all enjoy this part of the lesson, which we talked about the <clears throat> counting? Give yourself a double tap on the back for doing a great job. Circles appear on my, on my, <clears throat> my screen. So now there's something wrong. Let's sing the even song. There once a farmer had a duck and even was his name. Oh, zero, two, four, six, eight, zero, two, four, six, eight. Zero, two, four, six, eight, and even was his name, oh, be seated. Now, triangles appear on my screen. What are these triangles, anyway? Well, these triangles are, these triangles are the R numbers. So let's sing the odd numbers. There once a farmer had a pig and even was his name. Oh, one, three, five, seven, nine. One, three, five, seven, nine. One, three, five, seven, nine. And odd was his name. Oh, be seated. So you see, now that we finished the even and odd, we're going to get something even more different. So now read for me the even numbers. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 9, 17, 19, 19. So that is all. Those are all the odd numbers that we get to learn. But still, there are many odd numbers out there. Not just these numbers, but we can have 21, 23, 25, 27, 29, even 31. Just make sure that the ones or the units place has 1, 5, 7, or 9. Now we have our one addition family. Let's read it for me. When you do, clap like a dog. Quack, quack. Zero plus one equals one. One plus zero equals one. Zero plus two equals two. One plus one equals two. Zero plus two equals two. Zero plus three equals... Say again. Make sure that you do it the right, okay? Zero plus three equals three. One plus two equals three. 2 plus 1 equals 3. 3 plus 0 equals 3. 0 plus 4 equals 4. 1 plus 3 equals 4. 4 plus 0 equals 4. 3 plus 1 equals 4. 2 plus 2 equals 4. So now, did you get it all right? So now we've got it all. Now let's move on with our dot cards. Here in our dot cards, let's read, okay? 
This is how many ones? Three ones. Zero plus three equals three. Three plus zero equals three. Two plus one equals three. And then y plus two equals three. So that's how we do it. Next, two plus two and one plus one. What are they? As you know, they are doubles. So that's why I called only one person to do it for me and not the whole class. The whole class will actually be doing the twins. That's when I call two people or I call the whole class. Now we have two plus one again. Two plus one is three. One plus two is also three. Now I have my giant o'clocker. What is this? This is ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Now I have. Why does the hour? We got to say the hour before the minute. One, because the hour is shorter, so we say it first. And two, the hour has less letters than the minute. Okay. So now, are you really all done? If you are done, give me a wink. Now, what did you, what do you want for, the, what do you want for the dark cards? Now we're gonna do some doubles. We have three plus one equals four, and one plus three is four. Two plus two and one plus one, three plus three and four plus four, and other numbers say the exact same one. But actually, and, uh, but actually, but actually, in the numbers that we usually do, then the odd numbers don't have a twin. Only the even numbers have a twin. I mean, a double. So now I've got my, now I've got my hour, my hour point pointing to the number of four and my minute pointing to the 12. So that's when I have four o'clock. Now I want you to read the time that is presented on my screen. What is this? This is cheerlead for me, okay? Four o'clock, four o'clock. This is seven o'clock, seven o'clock. Make sure to cheerlead, don't just say. You need to cheerlead. Be a cheerleader, don't be a fan. This is nine o'clock, nine o'clock, 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock, six o'clock, six o'clock now we have the five edition family what is the five edition family used for let's see you know it doesn't have any doubles so let's go zero plus five equals five one plus four equals five Z two plus three equals five five plus zero equals five four plus one equals five Three plus two equals five.
Okay, so make sure to snap your fingers nice and quietly. Don't make it too loud or other classes will scold. Okay, so now that's all we've got. And now for the final round, we're gonna do something really interesting. Now I'm gonna tell you that the, the number of like, you know, the months. Let's read it. Now pop up when you say it, okay? January, February, March, April, May, okay? Again for the May. May, June, July, August, September, November, December. Okay, so February, I jumped up. I mean, May, I jumped up. Which means May is my birth year. And, Miss Cha and Mr. Chapel's birth year, he, Mr. Chapel, pops up at on the February. So his birth date is on February. So now as in February Now let's move on. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday, Sunday. Now let's read these numbers. Which number do you like the most? First, second, third, fourth, fifth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th. Ooh, be careful. 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th. 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 Make sure to be efe efficient. Efficient. Now we gonna Now have you got it all correct? If you do, wave at me. Good, I see a lot of wavers and good spellers coming up. And good spells. Good. Okay, so now did you all finish yours already? If you do, give me a clapping. Give me a few claps, stand, give me another few claps, and sit. Okay, so now, so now did you all get it all correct? and deny everything that you did it wrong or right do not cross out you have to deny that you're working by mistakes do not cross or maybe color them in so that i can't see your like stupid or maybe normal mistakes because all of us make mistakes and we change we learn from mistakes so don't worry if you even make zero mistakes just keep on doing your work do not worry if you have 10 mistakes or maybe zero mistakes or maybe nine mistakes it's just fine for failure are you all done if you do show me your expression by clearing out this now since you all had so much fun, we're going to do our 
we're gonna do our worksheet and then continue for one more game. We're gonna count from one to 100 and see who gets the most, okay? But first, let's do the worksheet. Draw checks to show the combinations. Write the sum. So the sum, zero plus five equals five. Five plus zero equals five. One plus four equals five. Four plus one equals five. Two plus three equals five. Three plus two equals five. Burn the remaining calendar numbers. Color the second Sunday yellow. Color the eighth day of the month orange. Color the 14th day of the month purple. Color the fourth Saturday blue. So now, fill in the remaining numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, Twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty. So now, how many days does September have? Well, September, as you know, has thirty days. So we just mark the 30, and then the 1 is the start. So now the colors you're going to do at home with your on-site teacher. Now let's move on with question 7. Circle the, thir circle the third turtle from the right. Draw a, draw a box around the fifth from the left. Draw a circle. Circle the third from the right. So the right is here. 1, 2, 3. Fifth from the left here. One, two, three, four, five. Met mark the words. So now that is our math worksheet. Now in our combination lesson, we're going to do this worksheet. Which, you know, involves these little combinations that you might get to do. So now, are you all finished with your numbers yet? Now I'm going to move to my 1 to 100 counting chart. And then let's count, okay? 3, 2, 1. 1. 1. 2. 3. 4. 5. 6. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So pause there. Now that was just the whole class. Now every twenty numbers we switch. The first twenty numbers, the whole class did it. The next twenty numbers, the girls do it. The next, the boys. The next, the whole class. Just like that until we reach 100. Let's move on. This time, the girls. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 
44. Now that we finished that, let's move on with the boys. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, the whole class, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, the girls, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 1, 90, 91, 92, 93, Almost there. 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So did you get all of your numbers from 1 to 100, right? I like all the boys which were mouthing it to me. Now, let's move on with our dot cards. For now, we're going to move on with our, <clears throat> with our times. Now, the times that we get to do here are really, really valuable. So make sure to save all of them until the next. Okay, looks, so now fix the screen a little bit. Now, I'm going to show you a time. And you're going to say it. 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 5 o'clock. So now make sure if you see 1 o'clock in the afternoon, do not say 13 o'clock, but only say 1 o'clock, remember. And also the other numbers that you see in the afternoon, but in the but in the morning, it's just normal, okay? But make sure to watch that in the afternoon. Okay, so are you done? The boys and girls who have done their worksheets, please become a squawk. Of your... Putting your... 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 Your beaks on when you turn into a squaw. How about make sure you be, um, how about now, once you finish your whole worksheet, please use something like your book or maybe even your arms or maybe your headrest to cover up the paper. Make sure, do not let anyone see the paper. It's only privacy, because you are the owner of this marvelous paper. Make sure to do that. And also, another thing to make sure is that you must. This thing is really a must. Be quiet when your friends are doing. Because if you're too loud, then your friends might get disturbed and they will put the wrong answer into, put the wrong answer into the box or maybe even color the wrong one. And they have to fix it difficultly. <laughs> Okay, so now is 579 an even or an odd number? 579 is an odd number. Other numbers as well, such as 103 is an odd number, 
102 is an even number. 5,000 is an even number. All sorts of different, amazing, interesting numbers. How about 68,579? That's an odd number. So thanks for the game, and then have fun. So it is the end of today's lesson, and see you next time.